Hey everyone, so um, this is like my first real coming back video, I guess, and I didn't know what to do because I didn't want to start off with like a haul or something, sorry, which is really hard for me to do because like, you know, it's the holidays and I've gotten like Christmas money already from out of town relatives and I've already got like some things that I've bought and or like gifts given to me from um, friends or whatever, but um, I was a little hesitant to do a haul because I didn't want to just start out with that. So I thought I would do a review of stuff that I have and stuff that I've been using for a while. And I like doing reviews because um, it might save the next person from buying something that is not going to help them or isn't going to benefit them the way that um, it's promised or should or whatever. Or it might, you know. Um, and tell you into something that you would have never thought of trying before or something like that. So, um, just to kind of go ahead and get into it, I'm going to be doing um, a hairspray review. And hairspray for me is like, I don't know, it's like it's like a vital organ. You have to have a hairspray. So, um, a teasing comb and hairspray are my two essential things for my hair because if you have those things, then you're pretty much set for whatever your hair is doing that day. Um, so, you know, I like, I go to school and I don't do my hair really fancy for school, but even if I do straighten it, I tease it in the back. I've even got it teased a little bit today and I've just done some Christmas shopping, um, but I do tease my hair a lot, and I do use hairspray to hold it. And especially, like, my bangs, I, I, I pull my bangs back a lot. But, like, I don't know. I just, I feel like I've tried a lot of hairsprays, and I don't just use, like, um, drugstore hairsprays. I really don't, like, I use expensive hairsprays, and so I really want them to work, and I really want them to hold up the whole day, and I've just, I haven't had a lot of luck. So, um... Three of the hairsprays that I have here are really, really good, and I would definitely recommend them. But there's one that I have that I, I don't recommend. Um, the thing that I have about drugstore hairsprays is I just feel like the formula isn't good enough, and I feel like they don't hold enough, but they smell good, and that's great and all, but it just it doesn't really work out for me. So the first hairspray that, um, if you remember from my old channel I've talked about a lot, is the Sebastian Shaper Plus, and it's um, it's Sebastian Originals Touchable, Touchable Extra Hold Hairspray with Humidity Resistance. This, like, I already, I have two bottles, right, or two cans right now, and I also have two cans of another one, but, um... The Sebastian Shaper Plus is definitely, it's the first real, like not real hairspray that I've had, but the first real big success I've had with hairspray, and my mom always used it, so of course, you know, like I used it because that's what she used or whatever, so um, I really had a whole lot of luck with this. I love it, um, and it's what my, I always kind of go off what my stylist uses and it's just it smells horrible and it, the smell could literally like probably kill a cat but um it's it's really good hairspray and it works amazing it holds all day long and it works awesome um so I was in Walmart actually and I bought a hairspray there and it's also Sebastian but it smells better so I thought okay well maybe if it's from Sebastian it'll work the same way but it just smells better and it's the Sebastian's Shaper Zero Gravity it says dry brushable lightweight control hairspray and um I don't like it I don't like it at all the the height different is barely and you can see that, I mean, there, it's a little bit of a smaller can, but not by much. But I do not like this. It's almost too light. I feel like I'm just, I mean, it, it smells good and all, but um, I feel like I'm just spraying on, like, water or something on my hair. Like, it doesn't work at all. I mean, it does, but, like, just not the way I want it to. It just kind of lightly holds your hand, hold your hand, hold your hair in place, and it doesn't last all day by any means. And another one that I have is the ISO. It's the Daily Finish Firm Hold Spray. 
and I've got two of these as well, and they're like have the same amount in them, which I don't understand, but anyways, uh, this works really, really, really good. Um, it smells a little bit better than this one, which is what I was looking for, and this is why I branched out from the Sebastian, just because the smell is awful. Like, it, it wouldn't make your hair stink, but it just smells like chemicals, and I don't like that smell at all. So, I went out looking for another one, and I found this one because it was in my salon, so I thought that I would try it, and it, it smells better. And it works better. It doesn't work better. It works about the same amount, but it works really, really good. And I really, really like it. And just depending on how firm I want my hair that day is determining what I use. And the last thing that I've really had some luck with, and I've gone through about three bottles or three cans already, is the Chi. It's by Chi. And it's, I don't know if it's Pharo. Uh, I don't know even how to begin to pronounce this. But it looks like that, and it says it's the Royal Treatment White Truffle and Pearl. So this smells good. I think, I think, whew, I'm getting a little British here. I think that um, all Chi products smell really, really good. So um, my hair stylist started using this, so I started using this, and this is pretty much what I use right now and then my backup is the, is the ISO but I haven't used a Sebastian in a while and I don't know why I mean I'm sure it works just the same and I still have bottles of it I guess it's just because the smell was so unbearable but I love this stuff no matter where I'm going what I have to do I even have like a little bottle that I bring with me and I bring this everywhere it is right up there next to my Diet Coke and um, my mascara, which is the components of my life. Uh, so, yeah, it works amazing, hands down. Love this one. So, from like a scale of one to five, I guess, one being the worst and five being the best, I would probably, let me see if I can, okay, I would probably do it like that. So these were actually pretty tough to choose between, but I would put this one first because it it was my first choice and it does um, hold better, but this one smells better and this one's just, I don't like it at all, but this one is top dog. So that's why. Yeah, that was my um, hairspray review and it's just, it was nothing really big or simple, but I was just sitting around and I really wanted to do a video for you guys. And I don't want to start out with anything crazy, so um, my shoe collection should be up. I think I'm going to try to put that video up before this one. So, um, yeah, that was my hairspray review. And I like doing reviews because I feel like it helps y'all out. So I'm going to try to do some more of those because I have a lot of new stuff that I've got. And I'm ready to um, review it for you guys. So, yeah, I'll just talk to you later. Bye.